If you were to look inside the Sun, or a gas giant like Jupiter, you would find a world under extreme pressures and temperatures. Looking even more closely, you would find a highly unusual state of matter that isn't a solid, liquid, gas, or plasma, but may still have the properties of all of them. Called warm dense matter, it's important to the understanding of the cores of gas giants and stars, the physics of planetary formation and stability, and fusion. And now, scientists have used SLAC's LINAC coherent light source to directly observe the physical properties of this matter as it forms, giving them new insights into how it works. To study this strange state of matter, scientists first had to create it on Earth by blasting small samples of coated aluminum foil with two high-power optical lasers. The lasers hit opposite sides of the outer coating at the same time, heating it up and causing it to emit powerful shock waves that crush the aluminum at pressures similar to those deep inside Jupiter. Scientists then sent an ultra-bright X-ray pulse from the LCLS straight into this newly transformed matter. By looking at how the X-ray light scattered onto nearby detectors, scientists were able to see its structure, and by changing the delay between the optical lasers and the X-ray laser, they could watch how it transformed from solid aluminum into the mysterious warm dense matter. The aluminum first compressed into a dense solid state, then began to melt, and finally transformed into a dense plasma. However, between the solid and plasma phase, scientists observed that the aluminum suddenly transitioned into warm dense matter, where it exhibited qualities of both a solid and a dense plasma. These observations paved the way not only for a better understanding of planetary formation and dynamics, but also advances in material science and fusion energy research, giving scientists a new way to look at the many processes that generate this hard-to-study state of matter. So, the next time scientists think about the core of Jupiter, the interior of the Sun, or how to replicate the fusion reactions that serve as the power source for stars, they can have a better idea of what's inside and how it got there.